Yes. All right. Oh, yeah. What's going For on, the Susan? first time ever, Mattel is selling a Super Bowl Barbie. <laughs> Wait, what? Are they jumping on the bandwagon? Yeah. What? <laughs> you know, I mean, they, they just came off of a very, very popular movie, and Barbie has been around for decades, mm -hmm. right? Which is surprising that there's never been a Super Bowl Barbie until now. And I'm guessing because it's Taylor Swift. You think so? Oh, yeah, because well, Taylor Swift made them even more money. Well, let's take a look at what that Super Bowl Barbie is going to look like, because you won't be able to get her until after the Chiefs and the 49ers face off on February 11th in Las hmm. Vegas. Hmm. So here's the deal. What you do is you can order it, and then you order the one that you, you want. It will come dressed in the winning team's jersey. And Oh, she's and, already dressed. Yep, Perfect. she'll have a hat. Perfect. And, the and Chiefs. A, no, no, no. She's, there, there's two different Barbie, Oh, I can't see. Two different uniforms. <laughs> They're long. She's even going to have a foam finger with the Super Bowl logo, but if you purchase the doll that wins the Super Bowl, you will get your doll. If you purchase the doll that does not win Super Bowl, you're going to get a refund. Oh. <laughs> oh that's ultimate rejection right there. That's salty. So you have to make sure that you pick the right doll or else you're just going to end up getting your money back. You know um, you know how they have the Super Bowl t-shirts, right? They have they print both teams, right? Yes. And the, the, the loser, the, those shirts go to some... Uh, a third world a country, third world country. clothing. They should do that with the Barbies. What? What third world country needs a Barbie? Those people want to eat. They need clothing. <laughs> How you know? A Barbie. How you know? You know what? I don't know. You're right. Oh, an easy big oven then. We should send easy big ovens. Though. Oh, shucks. <laughs> but looking at the, that, that, that outfit, right? I mean, I'm trying to I'm trying to like zero in on the color. Like, which one are they going with oh. the cheese, which is more like a lighter red, or my 49ers team, a deeper red? Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. But all I can say is you have um, starting February 25th, uh, up until February 25th, to order that doll, and dollars are going to be sent out in August. You guys all know I don't play with Barbie, but I think I'll, that, that'll be my first Barbie doll. <laughs> it'll, be, it'll be a first for everyone. <laughs> Whether or not you think the Barbie doll is a Taylor Swift lookalike, I can tell you that she will probably be at the biggest event of her boyfriend's life, the Super Bowl, mm -hmm. but he won't be supporting her at the Grammys this weekend. What? Granted, Ooh. I don't think it's because he doesn't care for her, but she's already breaking records with this Grammy show. She's the first songwriter to score seven noms for Song of the Year. She's also nominated for Record and Album of the Year. And if she wins Album of the Year, she'll break another record, overtaking musical legends Frank Sinatra and Stevie Wonder. It's going to be incredible. And of course, that show happens this weekend. Right on. So thank you guys so much. As a you, you know, you gotta hear this, mm -hmm. right? Right? Okay, we've got more coming up for you right here on Island Life Live.